Excellent, that's very good. I'm that. the winner. I'm the winner. In the first round, I get closer to Jack. That's why I was celebrating. I was closer than everyone. So we used to play a game kind of this game in Afghanistan, but they didn't use balls. Like they used the sticks, but the rules, everything was the same. When uh, the teacher was explaining to me, so it kind of reminded me that game. It was the same. But only they use the balls, but it was first time I used this kind of games and it's really fun. Watch this couple here bowl, this is what you're going to be doing for your first part. I've been invited along with my colleagues uh, from the British Crown Green Bowls Association, the Bowls Development Alliance and the local club to initiate these people into the wonderful world of Crown Green Bowls, which is probably the oldest sport we have in our country. In the first time, I didn't get close, but in the second time, third time, I did it. My class have a different country from people, and there is not a British or from UK, and it's useful for me to speak for British people or from UK people to learn more English. Liverpool City region is a region where adult skills uh, funding is devolved. So we're able to work with the city region in order to identify priorities. And one of the things that they've done is to make a test and learn facility available so that we can explore things that wouldn't normally be funded. So alongside them learning English as uh, another language, sometimes it's a second, third or even fourth language, they're also able to go out and about and explore the beautiful Liverpool city region. So today is one of the events that they're exploring. So not just playing bowls and obviously that, that activity, but also the history and heritage of Port Sunlight. It's a destination that is a beautiful destination within the Liverpool city region. And so it brings all those things together.